we are back on the road this morning, heading to our next campsite, heading south. Um, in a bit of a dilemma actually, because it's um, it's the bank holiday weekend. It's Whit Monday this Monday. It is currently Thursday. Is it Thursday or Friday? Oh, it's Friday. It's Friday. It's currently Friday. So we've got to find somewhere to stay at least Friday, Saturday. The shops are closed Sunday and Monday, so we need to shop for like four days. Um, so we might stay at this campsite for four days. We might stay for two. We'll have to see. Um, it's somewhere we've not stayed before. It's a new campsite for us. Um, I like it. We'll stay for one. Yeah, if we don't like it, we'll stay I for know. one. Six hundred meters cross the roundabout. Second exit. And just as a little aside, the lovely lady at the last campsite ran out to us um, when we were just leaving and grabbed um, an egg box and gave us six lovely fresh eggs from her chicken this morning. So uh, what more could you ask for? A fantastic campsite and free eggs. Awesome. Well, she, she, could have, she could have washed them. <laughs> yeah, they're covered in poo, but you, do not, you know what? Yeah. They're fresh, so who cares? Still warm. <laughs> they're still warm. <laughs> I've been looking forward to them. We a bit of scrambly egg on that's a on a bagel. That's for the next four days. No, it's not. Egg and a half between us. Yeah. So why are we headed south? Where are we going? I don't know. Well, we are kind of. I think we are kind of semi heading towards Nice. I think because the, um, Pyrenees or the Nice or Cagnes sur Mer is, is spelled. That Pyrenees is nowhere near Nice. Isn't it? No. Oh. That's the other side of France. Well, where's Cagnes sur Mer then? That is near Nice. Right then. Right. Why are we going there? Um, we're all because I went there when I was 18 and we got electric bicycles now instead of motorbikes. So we're going to see if we can cycle to Nice from there. So Rick's found a campsite. That's I cute. have, yeah. It doesn't answer anything on the internet, even though it's got a website. No. So <laughs> there's a bit of a gamble going on. Yeah, because it might not even be open, but we'll see. Well, that's, that's kind of roughly we're heading. If it doesn't get too hot or too wet. Yeah, I mean, like I said, the weather forecast is not the best the next couple of weeks. We've just seen a guy, an English guy at the last campsite and he's going home because the weather's looking he's rubbish. He's going to the north coast He's going Scotland. to Scotland because apparently Scotland's got better weather than here. <laughs> but we have got a fair old drive today to be fair. So we're trying to whiz down as fast as we can. No, we haven't. It's fine. Well, I say a fair old drive. For us, that, that's over a couple of hours. So um, for others, that's a short drive. <laughs> but for us, that's over. <laughs> we're on farm roads. Not we exactly are. in a hurry. No. I mean, it's not too bad, is it? So we've seen one motorhome <laughs> in half an hour. Yeah, seen one motorhome in about four cars. So we're doing all right. Turn right, then bear left. I think we are bare then. I think this might be it. Camping this side. Right, let's go in and have a look. Oh, very nice. A little place for us to stop. The white line. Right, let's go in and say hello. Hello. And this is the campsite that we've stayed at for the last couple of nights. A lovely campsite. Here we go, here's reception. There's a big long driveway that you drive down, park up. It is Camping Les Sol. There we go. And it's a site at Paysage, I can't say it, site a Paysage camping site. So it's part of a chain. Reception. Put yourself in, no issues, speak English fantastically, no problem at all. It's a barriered campsite, so they give you a key card that you have to leave a um, deposit for. There is a games room in there. You can rent bicycles. It is pretty much an all singing, all dancing um, campsite, this one. So they've got lots of recreational facilities, big kids playground around the back. They've got a bar, restaurant, which is just here, that is open at this time of year. And also a takeaway service and a little shop. And they have an absolutely, 
<laughs> I have an absolutely amazing swimming pool. The pool is fantastic. It's huge and it is heated and it is lovely and I had a fantastic swim in there last night. Awesome. And this is the ladies' shower room. Baby baths, sinks, <laughs> showers, push button showers, um, but they are temperature controllable. Very nice. Uh, and a free hairdryer. That'll do me. And a separate male shower block in there. Then along here, washing up sinks and sinks for washing your clothes. And then through here, weirdly, um, the loos, which are shared. It's a bit busy in there um, this morning, so I'm not going to film because there might be people in there. But basically, they've kind of separated it ladies this end, men's that end. Hand sink, hand dryer, and the toilet roll is outside in separate rolls. And the loos do have toilet seats. Yes. Okay, that was a quick recce. <laughs> and this is a very large campsite. It's very busy at the moment because it is a bank holiday weekend, so it's pretty much full. <laughs> Lots of tree cover, so great in the summer um, when the sun comes out. Not so much the case for the last couple of days. It's been raining for the duration of our stay, pretty much. But hey-ho, can't be helped. And here we are on our pitch. Lovely big pitch. All the pitches are of a really good size. On electricity. Axie affiliated campsite and this um, campsite has cost us 21 euros per night plus local taxes awesome stuff great little campsite good facilities oh hello <laughs> right let's crack on and head south let's go and find some better weather hopefully fingers crossed <laughs> 